but <clears throat> I just wanted to make this video real quick for y'all and just kind of show you how well the swirl filter was working. I hope y'all can see the uh, bits of debris that are shooting out of the pipe. You see some swirling around that's, you know, stuff that's already in there because I just kicked the pipe and knocked some stuff loose, but if you watch down on the, uh, coming out of the pipe, you'll see fresh debris uh, dumping out. And the inspiration for this video was that I just jumped up here and looked in and saw a lot of it coming out. I mean, it was just like almost a steady stream of poo coming out of that pipe. And it just goes to show you how, how much poo there really is in a system like this that these fish are producing every day. I mean, these aren't big fish. Um, but I just fed them, and so when you feed them, that gets them really stirring around. And so the immediate reaction to a lot of feed like that is that they they get a lot of uh, stuff stirred up off the bottom, and so a lot more poo starts to come through the system. So that's good, but um, I think it's time I do a little cleaning on this thing. Um, you know, it's still not perfect. I need to still get a filter pad put in here to go to keep solids from coming up, you know, because they're not settling out fast enough. So they're coming up and they're still getting through this uh, drain here in quite a bit. Now, you can't see it in the bio filter just because there's too much stuff, but if you look into this barrel, of course y'all probably can't see because a lot of you can see some down there on that uh, cross pipe. When we look in here into the last saw, you can see a lot of it settled out in there as well. And actually, interestingly enough, this has its own backwards swirl going on here in the sump just due to the flow of the water coming in it's actually swirling itself so i've got a lot of sediment down there on the bottom so i want to go through and just do a real good clean on the whole thing what i'll probably do is shut the tanks off and uh just siphon all the water out of all three of these barrels and siphon that off to get that poo out and uh, then i'll just refill with fresh water let it sit here and circulate for a while try to warm up and um then we'll go from there, you know, as far as a partial water change, it'll be about a 100 gallon water change, something like that. So not huge for the system, but I guess the system's really only running, really only running about 400 gallons right now anyway, so 100 gallon water change would be an okay water change. Uh, but mostly I want to do it to get all this debris out of here, so really just wanted to show off for a little bit, show you guys everything's running smooth, and uh, show you that squirrel filter. I'm sorry the lighting's so bad, but I'm trying to light with one phone and record with the other, it's just not working well. But. You can see plenty, plenty of poo settled out there on that pipe, settled on this pipe, and settled on all the other pipes. So we'll get all that knocked off, let it settle, and then I'll uh, clean this out here. Hopefully the next day or so, I just got back from a weekend vacation, so it's time to get back to work and get serious, get back to farming. <laughs> 